Hey, you probably know who I am. I'm Greg. Um, if you're watching this, it's probably because you're a friend of mine and I begged you to watch it or read it, uh, whatever. So, but welcome to my blog. This is the first post for uh, House Slipping on Tap. And um, if you know me, you know that I've got some quirks, uh, like the shirt. Um, I also have a lot of uh, interests. Um, you know that, uh, you know, I flew helicopters at one point. Um, I've flown airplanes uh, as well. There's a little thing right there, boop, of airplanes. Um, so those are definitely interests of mine. Of course, I can't fly helicopters. They're really expensive now. Uh, but I have got Megan and flying airplanes. But that's not what this blog is going to be about. This blog is about my journey in uh, real estate. Um, and I've been doing... Uh, when I say I've been doing real estate for a few years, I mean I've been investing in real estate. I've, I was, uh, I've been an accidental landlord before. I've been an intentional landlord before. I have flipped houses. Um, I recently got into this uh, basically marketing strategy where I, I, uh, it's called wholesaling. Um, I'm not going to go into all that right now. But the bottom line is I've, I'm in real estate now. And I realize that that's actually a business I want to continue with. Um, another thing I've done in the past is uh, I've brewed beer. Now, this is not mine, but one of the things I thought would be fun to do in um, journaling this journey uh, for my business um, has been to kind of combine some things that I really enjoy doing. So I thought uh, that's why, you know, we got the name House Living on Tap. I thought I like beer. Uh, I like to talk about things when I'm drinking beer. Um, and uh, maybe we can turn this into a regular thing. So um, at some point, we can actually have like real conversations with another person here. Right now, it's just uh, me and the dogs, and they don't talk very much unless you ring the doorbell, and they'll talk a lot. Um, <clears throat> anyway, so we'll get started. Um, and what I got tonight is uh, a beer by Swamphead Brewery. It's called Florida uh, Peeler, and they are... I have that memorized where all the breweries are from. Oh, <laughs> they're in Gainesville. Uh, you know, it's only funny because my daughter goes to FSU in Tallahassee. Um, so anyway, so we're gonna crack this open um, and go ahead and pour that. I do have a, uh, a Beer Week glass um, from uh, Perfect Plain downtown. I'm gonna see how that pours out. So anyway, there's that, look at that. Um, I mean, if you like beer, that's what that looks like, right? So, anyway, cheers. So what can you expect here from, from House Living on Tap? The shortest answer to that question is nothing. Hopefully a little bit of uh, entertainment, possibly. Um, maybe I will say something that triggers an idea, triggers a thought, triggers something in you um, that you feel like you really need to talk back, and that's fine. There's comments down below. Um, you can leave a comment. You can uh, tell me you know, any questions that you might have about uh, house flipping. Um, but really, this is just to kind of catalog the journey as I've gone so far. So in the next couple posts, you're going to see uh, maybe some before and after pictures of projects I've done before. Um, you're probably going to see a little bit of me talking about like how I got to uh, the business that I have right now, talking about you know um, the, the the money aspect of it, where does the funds come from? You know, when I say investing, what does that mean? Are there numbers involved? Things like that. Um, <clears throat> so that's what you can expect. So hopefully you'll tag along and, and watch or read. Um, and as far as like what do I expect to, what do I hope to gain from this? Um, you know, not a ton. I mean, I don't expect to gain a tremendous following of people who are interested in house flipping or beer. Um, it would be kind of neat to grow a community of folks who are interested in both and maybe connect with some folks who uh, I may already have, you know, uh, intersecting, you know, uh, spheres of, uh, I guess, influence with and you know, maybe connect on a different level. Um, would it be fun to meet out in town? Sure. But man, this is just post number one so let's not get ahead of ourselves so um why real estate i don't know it's fun i i um i enjoy acquiring the properties um i do enjoy um when it's time to re renovate them i do enjoy um 
getting you know dirty and the demo demo is obviously the most fun uh the construction portion can be frustrating for me because it never really looks the way i want it to look that's why i hire professionals and so i can just tell them hey i like that or no do it again um whereas if i have to do that to myself i just go in the corner and suck a thumb or something so i don't want to do that um but generally speaking the real estate the acquisition part of it the the um the uh, the renovation part of it, the the turning a product, uh, you know, turning an old house or, or a problem house into a product that I would be happy to live in, that's fun for me, especially if it's not while I'm trying to live in it. Because although that's a thing, people call it house hacking, that's not something I want to do. So, um, but we might talk about that later on. So, um, which brings me to another point: if you have any topics that you'd like to know more about, you want to see. Um, on this page or on this channel, if it's that kind of thing, uh, then let me know in the comments down below. Um, anyway, this is short, it's the first post. That's what I got. I'm gonna be talking about real estate. Might talk about a little bit of beer. And by the way, that's delicious, that Swamp Head uh, orange peeler, Florida peeler, I'm sorry. Swamp Head Florida peeler. And guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna link uh, to their website down below. You can probably find that if you're in Florida, you can probably find that in almost any Publix because that's where I find it. Um, but if you're not in Florida, I'm not sure where you're going to find it. So I'm going to link to their website and uh, you know give them a good review, so to speak. And um, anyway, it's delicious. If you like, um, you know, uh, the, the, it's you know the hops in it are what drive that sort of grapefruit taste, and that's I'm sorry that the grapefruit, the orange taste, but it's very citrusy. Um, and uh, Maybe next time I'll talk a little bit more about the beer. But that's it. That's the post. So um, until next time, uh, stay safe and, um, I don't know, learn a new dad joke or something.